Hello everybody, welcome to CCL Season 53 first round, the final round of 64. I've got another blitz, there's been a lot of blitzes in this. We've got I Ravel with Chorfs, a rather nice Chorf team, versus Demon Ted with a not so nice Lizard Man team. He has a Wizard, a Babe and Silly Billy, so he's down a fair bit of TV. Now, it's not a bad Lizard Man team, is it? It's just obviously outclassed by this Chorf team. And it's a pretty bad matchup if the if the chores can make removals and they've got four claws. Um, a strength four claw and two claw palm. No, one claw palm. So only one claw palm. But like god it's a violent team if they can if they can get on top of the uh, lizards, it's gonna be bad times for the lizards. God dodge hobgoblin. Oh man, yeah, <laughs> Throck can be the cheerleader with half star jumps. <laughs> it's actually too loud, now, isn't it? The end game sounds. That was a bit. That was a bit loud. Curl palm. Not yet, but I mean you've got to make the claw palm hit, right? Three, four, five, six. You should have uh, not done it. Oh no, he had to because of the guard. Yeah, we go. I guess it gets the cows. So apple's gone. Turn one. So the Crocs is still active. Interesting. But yeah, instant apple usage, this this is a this is a real problem for the lizards. Oh dauntless. So he's got a dauntless and a strength fall. Loads of guard. Yep, this is <sighs> I would not want to be demonted. He does, oh, he does have the sneak. He does have the super sneak that runs through. And maybe he should have bolted this turn. Honestly, literally, probably should have bolted this turn. Goes to five of these three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Double GFI away this turn. Maybe he should have gone for it this turn, and then the skinks come round here and here to stop the uh, bull centaurs getting back. It was probably the bolt this turn was probably the play. Honestly, um, and he's probably missed the only chance he had. Is. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, not probably, but there's a chance he's missed the only chance he had, right? Because if 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 the so if the uh, chops get on top, it's real bad times. And this certainly seems a chop team equipped to get on top. Here we go, no, no skills, gets a stun. <laughs> well, no kill skills. Oh, God. Yeah. We need a push. Re rolls. We woe. And this is there. Really nice. <laughs> I knew. <laughs> Do you know what, Dimmy? I knew if you fucking heard it, you'd say something. <laughs> Hello, Dimmy. Yeah, blo you know, you know what I meant. Kill skillless. <laughs> Kill skillless. Oh well. Uh, oh god. Oh, well, that's that's the drive done. Every, uh, at least now you don't have to stand up. Everyone's down, so no more claw pom hits this half. Bad part is him getting fouled. But um a relatively painless half. It's it's good in a way that it went so bad for the lizards. Actually really good. Really good for them that it went this badly. The the dirty players on the uh, on the bench. 
the, the this player can't foul because he's got the ball. This player can't foul because he's well not very good at fouling because he's good. This guy not very good at fouling because he's good. This is a pretty much a dream scenario for the lizards, <laughs> in a way. In a way, this is pretty good for the lizards. Like at least it happened in three turns with with only one cast. Demonted recognizes this. <laughs> and now he gets to follow this wrestler. back home pretty quick it was amazing I got to the train station at 640 and then the, there was a train that was due in at like 10 past 6 or whatever that was the that was like about half an hour late so I just jumped on the train at 644 literally just walked walked up the up the bridge across the bridge down the bridge and on the train didn't didn't wait for the train at all <laughs> absolutely glorious then walked off the train and straight into the taxi on the rank. So it was just like fish bosh bash, straight home. No messing. Did all my dailies on Marvel snap on the train back? <laughs> so like the the the, tr the train the train trip like wasn't you know what I mean like it was 28 minutes but it felt like nothing because it was just like Marvel snap do all the dailies and then just as I finished it it's like. We are now approaching Darlington. I was like, fucking get in. <laughs> Absolute perfection. Didn't kick any of my belongings down the crowded train. <laughs> oh, that was brutal to me. Poor, poor Dimrath. Didn't lose your phone. But, um. Dice it. Boy's got three stand firm to stop the one turn. And, uh. I, I mean, it depends what happens, right? What you pay on defense here, but. The three stand firm is a pretty you good one turn defense. Oh, sea brows! Bullshit. You can be mine. Well, hey, glorious. Hello, sea brows. Thank you very much for the raid. Welcome Sea Bros viewers. Gonna do three or four replay casts. Fuck off, Dimmy. <laughs> and then play all of the UKTC videos. A UKTC special. Extravaganza. Should be pretty fun. Probably got the best match of the UKTC. To be fair, to be fair, it was probably the best match. Um, McNaughton versus Stor. <laughs> like that's about the best match that can happen at UKTC. I think two absolute toxic scumbags. <laughs> oh wow! Well, there you go. That was a foul, wasn't it? That's what you get for defending one turns. You see, people criticise. My gaping hole against Christopher. But then, if you set up with your shithead stand firm guys on the line, we get gang fouled to death. I guess the miners' movement isn't that bad. Like, obviously, it, it's bad for the match, the, the fail, but at least minus move isn't so bad with, with stand firm. But that's a brutal, a brutal Kaz for I Ravel. Or I Ravel? Some people say I Ravel, don't they? I don't know. 
But I mean, this is a pretty, pretty, pretty major one turning threat. But but only move eight, right? Only move eight, but sidestep. Oh, is it sprint? No sure feet. So only move eight. The sidestep. I might have just tried to defend it normally and not expose the good players. It would obviously be tempting if you've got three stone firm, wouldn't it? But like that guy's your best player. Interesting. Super interesting. Oh wow, just eats the dub skull. Eats the dub skull there, demonted. Knows of course that to win the match he's gonna have to win in overtime. He's one nil down. But this is uh there's Kekwity and there's letting bulls in your backfield. So Phew. Phew. Oh, that's rowdy. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah, obviously the club one is there. And that opens the other flank up. So now both bulls are in the backfield. Maybe tag here. Yep. Tag the crocs. Keep him out. Oh god, this is looking really bad. For Demon Ted. Or demonted, if you prefer. And I quite liked him here. Because then he's tagging this down one who can be freed. And obviously this guy is then screened off. Yeah, silly billy. So I quite like this square for that hobgoblin. Yeah, demonted is pretty funny, isn't it? It's quite fun saying names wrong on purpose. I, you know, obviously... Kind of makes you look like an idiot sometimes, but it's also pretty funny, isn't it? Like, uh, Alba taking and constant thang over. <laughs> See, because he didn't tag that guy out, he's getting his bull blitzed with a uh, mighty bow. Okay, he got pushed, but... And Salibili comes through as well, so yeah, I really did like... I really did like this guy standing there. Oh wow. And the Dublay skulls. I wonder if we could block here and then we could dodge him out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. To blitz this one maybe. If you could block him and then dodge out around, blitz him, then he can obviously just block him. Oh yeah, he can just blitz him, just blitz this guy and, and that's way better. Okay, but well, he's gonna blitz with this one then. He's just gonna call upon. Of course, he's just gonna call upon. What an idiot I am. And there you go, Claw gets a Kaz. Interesting taking the ball down, I would have definitely taken the foul. Cheeky dodge. A cheeky dodge. Oh. I thought he had five rerolls there. So two Saurus down. That's not ideal. Bulls in the backfield. One on the loose. Demon Ted's in a bit of a pickle. Oh man, if you'd fail the GFI. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny. I 
has to reroll this. Does I Ravel think? Ball based. Fantastic assessment from Dimmy G, the champ. <laughs> oh, oh, Ducky. <laughs> <laughs> Timmy's a horrible bastard, he rips the piss out of me, it's it's fine, it's fine to say something. <laughs> horrible bastard. Lovely meeting you too, Dimmy. <laughs> Pretty great, wasn't it? It was pretty great. The uh, Nick Con, Jim Con, UKTC. The playing Blood Bowl part, universally hated. But uh, oh, can is this a hit on the ball? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, three dice on the ball. Three dice on the ball and a two plus. Pretty good. Yeah, so did I. Flip me. Yeah, I like that tagging, tagging the Crocs out with a rookie. Obviously, when you're up men, very powerful. Tagging anyone out on a one-on-one -one basis. Oh, he's got this one. Oh, that's even easier. Was it? That was, no, it was, yeah, that was two GFIs and now it was three GFIs. I didn't even look over that side of the pitch. It was hidden by the cards. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he gets the recovery as well going that way. <laughs> yeah, the Friday night was uh, was pretty extreme. Yeah. Yeah, sorry, I was I was dead as well. I was just fucking lying on the lying on the couch asleep in the in the you know in like the uh, the lunch room, whatever it what, what what's that? What the canteen? Whatever the fuck that place was. I was just asleep on the bloody uh, on the couch in there for most of the day. <laughs> Good juice and hearts. <laughs> paid off. The mango juice and hearts paid off. <laughs> Classic two day diet. Oh my god. Do you know what? Uh, Throic had an amazing idea, and I've also I've got an amazing idea related to it, right? Basically, what we could do for each other in Team Fantastic. Is make like cheesy adverts, right? We can make like cheesy adverts and then play them. You know, like how Kano has his has his like Blood Bowl related adverts. We could have like adverts related to like the streams and that. So, like for example, we could be like, <laughs> you know, if you're a, if you're if you're a, if you're a fat Blood Bowling bastard and want to lose weight, why don't you try Dimmy G's two day diet? <laughs> Need to get in quick in shape quick. <laughs> and like Hargrim can have his uh one one of X uh, not Hargrim, I keep calling him Throic Hargrim. Throic can have his uh can have his thing of like, you know, the Throic half body workout. <laughs> half star jumps. We could have them for like everyone, right? Everyone could just do like fucking cheesy. 
cheesy ads. It'd be pretty funny, I thought. Yeah, exactly, Ducky. Yeah, I like, like the old The canal conversions were pretty cool, I thought. But if we had it, like, with, you know, we could, like, advertise our kind of streams, right? How <laughs> you can have a half thing out? <laughs> Yeah. Man, I can't believe it. I just kept calling Throw and Cargrim. I don't know why. This is quite good, isn't it? Pushing here and pushing here. Keep them all trapped up, wrapped around the garden. Wrapped around the garden. We'll be on soon, Uber. Uber 47. Um, what I'm going to do is. Do a few games. Get the viewers up, see? Get the viewers up. Get the viewers up with a little bit. Tease them with a bit of Blood Bowl 2. And then drop the UKTC on them. I mean, there's nothing more to commentate now, is it? This is over. I mean, even, even Elliot would say this is over. See, it's over. Man. I need everybody to see the end of the second match, just so I can say things. <laughs> Maybe I should just cut out the end of the, of the second match, because the second match was a bit shit. Isn't he just Dimmy? Like, it's unbelievable how tall Nick is. He's a giant sitting down, yeah. Didn't use it. He didn't use it to his advantage, you know. He did not use He was slouching a lot in the tournament. I think if Nick had leaned into the intimidation route, you know, he would have done better. <laughs> Short standing up. <laughs> <laughs> oh god. It is wild. It is wild though. He's like he's, he's about like core height, isn't he? Core or sat height sitting down, it's unbelievable. And he's not as tall as them, standing up. Oh, wow. Pr pretty much no good dice for Demon Ted. And a worse team. Didn't get that banged out, actually. But... That double skulls that he ate to playing for all the time, you know, maybe he shouldn't have been eaten that. I can see why he did it, because like the only way he wins is with all the time. It's too exposed after it, wasn't it? Wow. It wouldn't have mattered anyway if he had 12 and 6 still got the win. Just a 2 minutes over win. There you go. Congratulations to I Ravel. Commiserations to Demon Ted. There you go. Um, 19 AV breaks to 4. I guess that was the story of the match. But there was a big miss next game for the Chorfs. And uh, yeah, I mean, they were, pretty, they were a pretty rowdy team. Right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.